Meet the big boss himself, Larry. Throughout his 16-year lifetime, he has viewed himself as a powerful, sturdy warrior, and it shows. Unfortunately, like most warriors, he has experienced some bumps in the road, such as acute paralysis, possibly due to a stroke, and the dreaded laryngeal cyst, which took its toll on his meower. Today, it was time for Larry's annual exam and shots with his lifelong veterinarians, Dr. Hensley and Dr. Yock, at the Cat Clinic in Enid. The Cat Clinic's main goal is to educate pet owners, give accurate diagnosis, and provide excellent care for pets. Dr. Joyce Yock founded the practice in 1989 and still owns and operates it today. Today, Larry will see Dr. Ann Hensley, a veterinarian with over 20 years of experience. Ann will be administering a maintenance dose of laser therapy to Larry. While not all clinics utilize this type of treatment, it has seemed to help Larry with his overall mobility. I've read that uh, not many people like bring their cats for laser therapy because they don't recognize the cat is in pain. Yeah, a lot of people uh, don't realize that their cats are in pain. They think, oh, they're just an older cat and they're sleeping more. And so, uh, you know, we can ask them questions that may help them realize, oh, yeah, hey, um, maybe we do need to get, you know, get her some pain, pain relief. So uh, we talk about, you know, different types of treatments for pain. And we try to determine, you know, is this an arthritis thing and where is it? Oftentimes in older cats, they can be many joints involved, the spine and the hips, elbows, knees, all kinds of places there. So uh, to deliver laser treatment, we do have to do some x-rays so we know where to focus treatment. So, And that's good to know. And it's nice uh, to be able to show pet owners, you know, where the animals are having problems and such. Because oftentimes they really can't tell unless you... You know, show them something, you know, visual. just a little poke. It's okay. It's okay. It's already okay. You know, people may notice or not. Larry began receiving laser therapy treatments four years ago after he was found on the patio unable to move. At the time, the doctor speculated he may have suffered a stroke, leaving him with acute paralysis of his hind legs. His examination and x-ray shows arthritic changes in his sacrum and knee joints, so he began treatment with pain and anti-inflammatory medications, followed on with laser therapy. Where is the pet having his problem in section? So Larry has uh, problems in his back, in his sacrum, so that's where the, the spine that's over the pelvis, that part of the vertebra right in there, and then also in his knees. So both of his knees have really bad arthritis. So we're gonna laser his caudal spine and his sacrum, and then we're gonna do laser on each of his knees there. And we to start treatment, very initially, we will do a series of six treatments spread over about three to four weeks. And then after that, we will taper down to maybe every other week, then maybe once a month, and then sometimes like as needed sort of thing. So. Today, Larry's checkup okay. revealed a mild case of conjunctivitis, commonly known as pink eye in humans, and the need for dental cleaning and possible extraction of some teeth. Unfortunately for Larry, periodontal disease is the most common condition for diabetic cats. Larry, as well as his brother Magic, were diagnosed with diabetes at age 10. They both receive insulin injections twice a day. Larry's diabetes has disappeared and resurfaced a few times over the years, a common occurrence in diabetic cats. Much of the time, Larry's day is spent with the Red Dogs, LeBron and Serena. While with them, Larry will engage in napping, a stare-down which involves monitoring their movements, and fending off LeBron's rough housing. Despite his age, he manages to hold his own and maintains his title as Boss Man. 